Hey guys, it's Daniel here from Pathways Physiotherapy in Ferntree Gully and we're here with our third video of the low back series. If you haven't checked out our other two videos, make sure to tune into our Facebook page in the last two weeks to have a look at them. Today, we're gonna to be going through an exercise called the Modified Curler, which is a really good way to work the muscles through the front of your trunk and your core. This is also a great variation for those of you who are dealing with quite a sore back because with some people, performing something like a normal curl up or a sit up can be quite challenging when you do have back pain. So this is a great alternative that you can try. To perform the modified curl up, start off by lying on your back with one leg bent and the other leg straight. Place both your hands underneath your lower back, which will ensure that your lower back stays in a neutral position. This position is useful since a number of people with back pain can find that bending forward or flexing their spine can flare up their symptoms. So this lets you work to improve your core strength without too much back movement at the beginning. From this position, lift your head and your shoulders slightly off the ground and hold this position for a few seconds. Think about using your abdominal muscles to pull yourself up, but not too far that you feel your lower back pushing into your hands. Try and aim for a 10 second hold and start off by going through five repetitions of this exercise. If this is too difficult, you can reduce the time of the hold until you build more strength. If you need more of a challenge, you can lift your elbows just off the ground and perform the same exercise, which will make it a little bit more unstable. If you find you can control this movement quite well and your back symptoms stay under control, then a progression of this exercise is the roll down. In this progression, you're aiming to slowly roll down onto the ground and then slowly roll back up, aiming to control each part of the movement without swinging your arms for momentum and with your feet flat and relaxed on the ground. So that was another tutorial of an exercise that you guys can try when recovering from low back pain. Let us know what you think of this video series so far. We've got one final video coming up in the next week, so stay tuned for that. I hope this has been helpful and thanks for watching.